Hi friends and family, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. I'm so glad you decided to click on this video. This is my first sit down video in the new apartment, which is kind of crazy. I have not done one of these in quite a while. Um, but if you do not know me, my entire channel is based around my thrift business. And Hello, if you are actually new, I think you deserve a real and a little more normal instruction to me. I am not usually this calm. I don't know how many cups of coffee I had that day that I just kind of leveled out energy wise, but um, hi, I'm Julia. I also just got this microphone and I'm so excited about it. So the voiceover is really clear, crystal clear in this video, but I wanted to formally, informally, introduce myself yeah i'll let calm julia continue but check out my other videos to see if you vibe with the real me um would love to keep you guys around i do a lot of business related stuff so i also hope you like the microphone <laughs> and one part of that is shipping and how i ship along with how I package all of the items that you guys buy from me. And so I wanted to do an updated video about all of the little details and all of the work that goes into packaging items for you guys. Just pretty much everything that goes into it, even the thank you cards, because there's so many details that have changed since my first video. And so I'm excited to show you guys what has changed and how much better it has gotten. With that being said, I hope you guys do choose to subscribe to my channel if this is helpful to you. I do a lot of business related videos as I continue to grow my business at Thrift Like You Meet It on Instagram. And I'd love for you to check that out if you don't already know about it. That is exactly what my YouTube is based around. So I do a lot of thrifting content here because that is what I sell is thrifted clothes. They're all sitting behind me right there. So without further ado, let's ship some items. Okay guys, so this is the point of the video where we are getting prepared, getting ready to ship. So I have all of my things together, my scale, my stickers, and then the clothes. And then we start. So of course we're going to start with the box, which obviously I have never folded this box before. Absolutely befuddled by the box. The box became the master and I became the student. Um, and then I just decided to tape the whole thing together because quite obviously this was my first time with said box, but I got it. Look at that. Look at how proud I am. Oh yeah. How good. So fun. There you go. And then of course we're going to package the items. So this jacket had a little bit of lint on it. So I got it off with a little lint roller and then I put the first layer of tissue paper into the box. I want this to have like kind of a glossier vibe whenever people open it and whenever people experience like the opening experience and I'm filming a, a video you gonna say hi to the the YouTube <laughs> and that was Noah who also just started a thrift account so if you ever feel like you want help just reach out to me but this is the end product of the packages I hope you guys like them hello guys welcome to the segment of the video where we talk about thank you cards and how important they are I'm going to walk you through how I make mine Essentially, I will show you some example pictures of what my past ones have looked like and what they look like now. There's been a lot of like trial and error. Handwritten has always been better. And having those like sentimental real life connections with your customers has a lot to do with how your business is gonna do. And so I have already done the watercolor on these. So this is what we're working with. Um, I just have to write on them and then we're pretty much done, but I'm gonna show you everything that I use. It feels really homemade and I want it to feel really personal when people open boxes for me. And so that's what I chose to go with. And now I have to write what's on the cards for these so that I can ship this with the items that I'm shipping out today.
box should not look like that when I tape it. <laughs> but I figure it out by the end. It's just so, it's so funny to watch me change. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> Okay, voiceover Julia's back. So we are gonna talk about pirateship.com. I have used this since I started my business and I will always vouch for it, but it, it is literally as easy as it looks. You just put in the information and you measure your box and you have to have some kind of postal scale that'll give you pounds and ounces. And once you put all of that information in, it'll give you some of the best deals, like, in, in, like you literally can't find them anywhere else. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how I package my items. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe for more. See you guys later. Bye.